My parents moved us here to Salt Lake to run a restaurant. And in 1985, they opened Red Iguana on 300 West. My name is Lucy Cardenas, and I own Red Iguana, Red Iguana 2, and Taster Red Iguana, along with my husband, Bill Coker. The recipes that the Red Iguana features are all from all over Mexico. They're all family recipes, and they've been using them and uh, refining them since 1965. Red Iguana is primarily known for its moles. It's one of the few restaurants in the United States that has any moles at all. And yet, Mexico, it's one of the most famous dishes that come from Mexico. And uh, most restaurants, if they have a mole, they have one. Because we're using family recipes, we have some seven to eight moles on any given day. My parents decided to go into the restaurant business to feed their family. Um, I don't think they ever thought, you know, we're going to make it rich, we're going to make it, you know, it's going to be this big deal. They, they, they had a passion, they wanted to support us and offer us a good life, and Salt Lake made that possible for them. The, the Red Iguana truly is a, a labor of love. It's all about the family legacy, it's all about the opportunity we've had here in Salt Lake, um, that Salt Lake has given us. Um, allowing us to grow, allowing us, uh, supporting us, and making it possible to continue doing what we do. We realize very quickly that the fabric of the community really depends on the small businesses in the community. The, the small businesses are the heart and soul of, of any city. I think Salt Lake is attracting a lot of creative people. The food scene has changed so much and I'm just happy that there's just a lot more choice. There are lots of great restaurants out there. Uh, we want them to come to Salt Lake. Salt Lake is a great place to come and do business. We definitely take a lot of pride in what we do and there's a lot of potential and it's just getting better all the time. Red Iguana is Salt Lake. <laughs>